the recommendations of the Stephen Ross IA's report of 2012. Its other committee on restructuring of government agencies and commissions says it will hold a one-day public hearing to that effect. Jokia Adisa has details. Twelve years after its submission, the Stephen Orosai report is still generating ripples in Nigeria. President Bola Tinubu recently directed a second look at the recommendations from the report. Now, the Third House of Representatives has also moved to revisit the report. The committee, chaired by Ogun State Legislator Isiaka Ibrahim, plans a one-day public hearing to listen to the views and contributions from members of the public. When the federal government came up about the implementation of RSIR's report, and the House, in its wisdom, felt, no, we can't take that in isolation, one. Then, two, 12 years report, the current reality of the country, is, you know, even five years ago, you cannot compare the two. It believes it is important for the parliament to review the Stephen Orosanyo report and all other white papers on the same subject matter. Our goal is to apply the legislative approach in streamlining operations, eliminate duplication of functions, enhance service delivery, and optimize resource allocation. The lawmakers are led the fears of many citizens over likely staff rationalization as it says its mandate does not extend to proposing retrenchment of workers. Some agencies were created for a certain exigency of time in the past. Perhaps maybe many, some of them have outlived their function. It is the duty of the National Assembly now to review all those. If it is to strengthen them, I will look for more functions for them. So be it. The committee says so far, it has captured 1,310 organizations and will be identifying redundancies, duplications and areas of improvement within the system. The Stephen Orosayo report outlines recommendations to streamline government agencies with the ultimate goal to boost efficiency and cost effectiveness and the parliament assures Nigerians the comprehensive review will consider diverse perspectives and expertise to guarantee evaluation an effective reform. Jokia Adisa, TVC News, Abuja.